A young couple with a new baby realize the great suburban nightmare. A college fraternity has moved in next door. Now they must outbox the president of that frat if they want to have any chance at a good night's sleep. Neighbors takes a funny and smart approach to the mundane horrors of everyday life. We see frat boys come face to face with their future in the form of Seth Rogen as a new dad and husband. Well, hey man, if you guys ever need anything or we get too noisy, just talk to me or talk to Pete. We'll take care of it. Same with us. I mean, we get pretty loud over there. Yeah, yeah. We're Game busy, of Thrones, so. we get loud. When Khaleesi comes on, I'm like, oh, yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Watching two generations try to find common ground brilliantly creates more tension and drama than you'd think. The film doesn't take sides with either the parents or the frat. Instead, it merely lays out a scenario for both parties to collide and shows you the carnage. Hello, I think the frat broke into my car and stole the airbags. Uh, Why would they just break in and steal the airbags? I don't know, we should follow police. <laughs> <laughs> The performances from Zac Efron as Teddy the emotionally enigmatic frat president and Rose Byrne as a new mom elevate the crass humor and the constant jokes between sex, drugs, and cute babies. The laughs they come at a constant pace with only a rare thud here and there. Neighbors will make you fondly remember your days as a stupid 20 year old while also celebrating the wonders of going to bed early, a 9 to 5 job, and the domestic bliss of raising a family. I'm John at the movies.